This is a short video to give some information on how to get around the problem of a Western Digital hard drive that wouldn't work when it was in its enclosure. The hard drive is a 500GB SATA WD500 AADS Green Caviar drive and it was originally in a Western Digital enclosure. Removed the top from the enclosure to find that the drive has a USB uh, board. The USB board has a failed component. Small component here is burnt out next to the power socket and the USB socket. This board is a Oasis Desktop 1607P and it is revision B. On removing the board from the drive realized the drive might be able to work so I purchased an Inatech docking station with the correct SATA connections on it. This is connected to PC via a USB 3 port as a power socket as well. This docking station has a small blue light that indicates when it's reading and writing to the drive. Fitted the drive to the docking station and the drive was uh, fully accessible, able to read and write. So it wasn't the drive that was, had failed at all, it was just the USB card that is inside the Western Digital Enclosure. Uh, it took us a while to get this organised, but it means now as well as having able to get this drive to work, there is other drives that I have and I'll be able to use the Inatech docking station for that as well. Thank you.